To the East Coast now, where a major federal mob bust has rounded up more than 40 suspects from New England to South Florida. The FBI says members of several reputed mafia crime families allegedly formed an unusual alliance operating as part of a massive syndicate known as the East Coast Enterprise. ABC's Lindsay Davis has the latest. It's one of the biggest mob busts in years. More than 40 suspected mob members were arrested in a massive bust that spanned five states, allegedly involving four major New York City crime families. They were involved in casino style clubs, credit card fraud, health care fraud, firearms tracking, trafficking, and ar arson. One suspect was accused of ordering an associate to attack a panhandler outside his restaurant and, quote, break his knees. Among the suspects arrested, many colorful nicknames like Tony the Cripple, Mustache Pat, and Nicky the Wig. Pete the Killer. Who kind of names you've heard before in classic mobster movies like Goodfellas. Jimmy Two Times, who got that nickname because he said everything twice, like... I'm gonna go get the papers, get the papers. Also arrested in a separate case, the grandson of the Teflon Don, a.k.a. John Gotti. The 23-year-old grandson, also named John Gotti, was arrested after police say they found 500 oxycodone pills and $50,000 cash in his New York home. The various racketeering charges from loan sharking to gun running could put them in prison for up to 20 years each. Lindsay Davis, ABC News, New York. Our thanks to Lindsay. Wow, pretty impressive. 46 arrests, huh? I love the mundane details, though, of them, like, uh. meeting at rest stops right. along highways. And speaking in code language, and 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 it, it is like an episode of The Sopranos. It is. Jimmy two papers, times. But get the papers. Jimmy get the two papers. times. <laughs> One of my favorite movie lines of all time.